Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam said, On the day of judgment, a caller will call out, Where is Zain al-Abideen? Where is the jewel of the worshippers? And Ali ibn al-Hussein alayhi salam will step forward. I often wondered how one receives a title like the jewel of the worshippers. Is it because his face would turn pale and he would shake in his prayers out of fear when others don't even know that it's time for prayer? Is it because in the darkness of the night when evil envelops the people that his du'as used to be whispered through the air? Is it because he would prostrate until the skin on his forehead becomes hard when others won't even go into sujood to say shukran lillah? Or is it because on the day of Ashura he said, Fetch me a stick so I may stand and a sword so I may defend my father when our labbaik dies on our lips? No, if you ask me what makes Zain al Abideen, it is not just the hours of prayer but also the resilience and attitude to difficulty. Because like the jewel that is cut by the jeweler so that its shape and shine dazzles the admirer, Ali ibn al-Hussein alayhi salam was cut in this world and that is what made him Zain al-Abideen alayhi salam. <laughs>